Hey beautiful people, welcome to the vlog! Woo! I love you so much. Mwah. I don't even know how to do an intro anymore. I just go woogum 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 like hi. <laughs> So I am right now uploading my video. It has two minutes left to upload. It is almost 11 a.m. My mom and my auntie are both coming to get me at like 11.30, so I have about an hour to get ready. So let's get ready. I've been drinking water all morning. Okay, so we're going out for lunch, so I didn't want to have breakfast and ruin my appetite. I don't know where we're going yet. I'm gonna do a little bit of makeup. The weather's a little weird today, so <coughs> excuse me, I'll see what kind of ah, guy outfit we're gonna have. Ah. Okay, I think we found the fit. I found this sweater in my closet and I was like, I don't remember where I got this, like at all. And I was like, cute little pink sparkles here. I feel like this is gonna bother me throughout the day, this little itchiness, but um, I am wearing my little high-waisted jeans with it too. Yes, I keep washing them and wearing them. I love them, I thrifted them, and they literally go with everything. It's just like a casual little lunch date. And then um, we are going to visit my uncle um, who is, um, a, de a dementia patient so he's in a special ward so I just want something like comfy and like not too overdressed and not too like slutty or tits out or anything like that so just like jeans and a comfy little shirt I feel like is um, perfect I really don't know let me bring you into the other room because I really gotta start getting my shit on already I've been um worried uh, worried i don't know if that's the right or i don't know if there's a right answer for how i'm feeling because i haven't seen my uncle since he's been in the war he's not himself anymore and everyone keeps telling me that like family members i don't want to go too depth in i'm obviously not gonna go in there and film him or anything like that i'm not gonna be disrespectful or like that i just don't know if he's gonna remember me he remembers my auntie that um so my auntie's gonna come with us there could be a chance where he does remember he has good days and bad days it's just something that i don't know what I, I just don't know what i've never experienced something like this before one reason why i'm glad i have a platform when i have something that i'm going through in life a lot of you have already going have, bleh, have already went through it or are going through it or maybe have never and want to like you know follow along the journey that's one thing that i do love about social media so i just have like mixed emotions and i was just open with my mom last night i was like i'm just gonna be honest like i'm not backing out i'm not saying i don't want to go i'm not saying i'm scared it's just i don't know how to explain it and she's like oh samantha she's like i felt the exact same way when like you know i first went we'll see we'll see what happens also my shaver shit has run out of battery so i literally have like i don't even know oh <gasps> wait i bought those little oh, hold on oh yes these <laughs> you never told me i said what <laughs> i said yes i did yeah. i was like oh i'm so excited for yeah that was a while ago <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness oh, i know right <laughs> oh, 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 i thought no. are you kidding me <laughs> Oh, good. The men's is open, but this is why? Why is the women's you have to use this key? I don't know. <laughs> Delicious. So good. There's bon mis being made. Oh, so good. It was very, very good. Yes. Oh, look, that's what we got right there. Yeah. Thank right you there. Very much. Thank you. <laughs> this is my beautiful family right here. <laughs> We're trying to math. It's really busy right now. I'll get the hell out of here. <laughs> People can't wait. That is the most <coughs> rude, is a disrespectful a thing. You know that? Why you see me this? pulling out. I can't see you, but heaven forbid that you have to wait for me. Maybe just once. Five minutes. That's the picture you should take. Five freaking minutes. Jerk off. One of these days, I want to punch you. You're going to have to gonna <laughs> On this. Right in front of you. Oh. Yeah. Guidance will be at this volume. Guidance will be at this volume. Oh god. Okay, that's fine. Guidance will be at this volume. <laughs> I'm gonna say that again. Guidance will be at this volume. Guidance will be at this volume. Guidance will be at this volume. Change it to Japanese. Let's listen to it. When I open my back door, look, don't mind some of the little pee little spots, okay? But anyways, look at these cute little uh, doggy paw prints when I open the door. It's so cute for them like waiting at the door like, look 
at that. It's so cute. Yes, I'm in shorts. Hello. Okay, so just got home from hanging out with my auntie and my mom. We went to a place. I don't even want to pronounce it because I will butcher the pronunciation, but it, this is with the word right here. The newer restaurant in the city, it's very tiny. Um, The food, amazing, literally amazing. We each got a noodle bowl, so good. They were like $15 each, and then it comes with fish sauce. And then on the side, there was like unlimited chili oil. Yeah, I may have taken all of it. <laughs> It was amazing. It was a cute little noodle bowl date. Okay, let me talk about my uncle. Let me just sit down here. Okay, so we visited with him for a few hours. I was not scared. Like, it's my uncle. It's my family. I just, I didn't know how to act. I don't know if that's the right word, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna talk and be open. I'm sick of, like, filtering myself, right? If I'm not gonna, like, say, like, some shitty shit, but, like, I'm sick of, like, being, like, careful on my word, but I still want to be me and authentic and tell you guys, like, how I feel. But anyways, when I walked in, in there I noticed right away that there were doors and they had like murals painted on them and I saw on TikTok a girl that does paintings for dementia wards she was explaining it and I I was able to explain it to my mom and my auntie a lot of the patients wander around and then can get lost and go through doors so if there's pictures painted on the doors like murals or in this case there was like sunflower like a, like a bed of sunflowers if a patient were to walk walk and wander they they wouldn't notice that they are doors if that makes sense like if they're wandering and you know they might not clue in that those are doors so they'll turn around and just go the other way right so there were um sunflowers there was like a huge like it was like a bookshelf like a whole bunch of books there was like a barn with like a field and there was a barn that was the door we were supposed to go out of and we passed it because we didn't even know it was a door like <laughs> meant to be like that it was actually very interesting to see something that i actually knew about on tiktok and somebody doing it for a good cause and it being like there in front of me and it brought a tear to my eye and my uncle has his own room all i'm gonna say is like my uncle had a hard life so to see him have his own room he has a clean living space he has health care he has nurses waiting on him he has a really comfortable life and living situation it was just something that made me and my heart happy for him. He seems so content. There were um, times where like, I didn't know how to respond to that, but I'm so glad my, my one auntie, she's so good. I just didn't want to say the wrong thing. You know what I mean? Being there to support, I feel like is the most important thing. And he remembered me. Well, I, I, I think he did, right? We were showing him pictures on our phone. I'm not going to go into personal details of everything else. I'm very glad I went and it's not going to be the only time I go. I'm not going to say to you guys, like if you have somebody go see them or something like that, that really really is a personal decision for me and my situation. My uncle was so happy. Like, uh, he was so happy. He was like, thank you so much for coming to visit me. And uh, like, it was so, so nice. And we were just showing pictures, talking about memories, um, joking around, just so happy. And thank you guys for being here with me and for listening to me, hearing what I have to say. And it was just really, it was hard. It was hard to get there. But once you, we were there, it was just, that's my uncle. That's my family. Regardless of whatever situation he's in, that's that's what situation he's in right now. I feel like almost like weight lift is lifted off of me, like at ease. I feel like I know he's well taken care of. The nurses were so amazing. My mom said, why not? Because you're so good at like journaling and stuff. Make him a scrapbook so he can see because he loves looking at photos. And on the phone, he can only look at it for so long, right? He's like just like looking at it for like two seconds, right? Looking at it on a phone. And, and then he's like, there's a glare and stuff like that. So I think I'm gonna make him a scrapbook of like older pictures, newer pictures of people and like label them. I think that's gonna be fun. I'm gonna work with my mom on it. So it really went well and I'm so happy. Like I'm just so happy. Ah! Okay, so Austin just got home. I have some old clips. I do have a ton of old clips. So I'm just gonna show you a few old clips for the rest of this video. I think I'm just gonna like take it easy for the rest of the night. Here's some old clips um, to get those out of the way right here. Cause I know you guys love seeing old ones. Here you go. Okay, finally time to take down all these decorations. Everything is so beautiful and magical, but it's gotta go. In the words of Mori Povich, until next time, America. <laughs>
this bag. Okay, tonight we are having this. This is Fine Herbs Pork Sirloin. Da -da 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 -da. Put a little rosemary on it too. And we are putting it in the crock pot. It's time for cooking with some man. Just go like this, grease that. I feel inclined to say like cooking on a budget with this one, I don't know. As you guys know, I'm limiting my um, beef consumption. Cows are just too cute. I'm not doing it, I'm not doing it. I did it by accident a few days ago because I ate a poutine and I was like, this is beef gravy. So like something like that, I was like, mm. this is pork tenderloin, look it, $12. Okay, so I'm gonna open this and you might be like, ew, $12? <laughs> I don't know, baby. Will you? If you do mind your business. Oh my God, why can't I open this? It's a really good brand name. Their stuff is so good. So we're gonna have this with some mashed potatoes and some veggies, if I can get it open. The pork was expired. <laughs> Expires the 26th. That's today. When I opened it, I was like, not eating this. But I was like really excited to make that. I got all the Christmas decorations down. This Austin shop. <laughs> because I fuck it up every time. So this is the only thing he needs to do. And Patrick's stab. Patrick's stab was full of snow outside. So um we've we've had him in the garage to like defrost or like get all the snow off to put him back downstairs. But this is what this looks like. So we're back to having this. I kept the Christmas cards up just because they're like a little sentimental. I've shown you guys this. People have been asking me, asking me questions about this and why I have this. Like, why do you have a sugar skull? This is actually um, Austin's cousin and she is no longer with us. She's passed away and she made this. And it was very um, important to her. It's a beautiful sugar skull. So that's why we keep it up here. I've just never addressed that. It's kind of just like um, memories, good stuff. And then there's like Psyduck. Like, okay, some candles and then some Christmas cards. I'm gonna keep the Christmas cards up, but everything else is gone. Yeah. Ooh, sad. And where's this picture? There was two pictures. Oh, right here. Okay, so this just like drew me in the packaging of this. It looks super cute. Has anyone heard of this? They're like, it's deodorant, I think, but it says head to toe. Does anyone have any recommendations for this? Let me know because it's super cute. Packaging is drawing me in. All right, boys and girls, we have redone the pork. <laughs> Purchased a new one, um, made the sauce and everything. We're just letting it rest, making some carrots here. They look ugly right now, but they won't in a bit and then some um, stuffed mashed potatoes or like, stuffed baked potatoes, sorry. Let that meat roast. Woo! Okay, wait, sauce. Um, this looks super good. I don't know why he gave me such a huge pile of carrots, but I guess carrots apparently make you tanned. So I guess I'll have tanned skin. There it is. Throw a little pepper on. Yum. Got my hair freshly bleached and done. So happy with it. It's like a golden, more goldeny this time. Well, it is like golden hour, so it looks even more golden. Um, <laughs> but the roots are gone. Nails done tomorrow. We're about to be back in business. I haven't been really feeling myself. There's been a lot of things. January has sucked. And it has sucked for pretty much everyone I know. Everyone I know. I hope January was is going good for you guys. Are you guys watching this? Whatever. But January has been the worst month of... Ugh, of the year I was gonna say, but it's the only month so far. Tomorrow's February 1st, so I'm hoping for good vibes in February, but this month can literally choke. January can buy. <laughs> I don't know who can relate, but goodbye. Hey guys, I'm getting my nails done. Here's a little before. <laughs> I'm gonna try to focus on you, Sophie. <laughs> what did you say to me? <laughs> before and after. Oh my God, you guys, these are probably my favorite nails I've had. I say that all the time. In literally a year, like bye. These are so cute, perfect for Valentine's Day. Look at how cute. Starting out February strong. Um, yum, roasted red peppers for $1.50. I'm getting them, they be good in salads or wraps. The best is yet to come. It's such a bright, sunny day today. You guys can see the snow is all melting. It's like plus seven. I'm so happy. I'm wearing shorts. <laughs> Some of you guys might be like, what? If you live in like America and have never been to Canada. It's shorts weather. <laughs> I just hope it stays that way. It's Groundhog Day. And I just realized, well, like you just explained to me what Groundhog Day was. Yep. I can't believe that's a real <laughs> thing. So a groundhog, wait, explain it to them. Oh, like I'm so bad at explaining it. So a groundhog comes out of his time. 
what is it, tunnel? What? Like his, his hole? His hole. <laughs> yeah, Groundhog comes out of his hole on, what is it, February 2nd? Yeah, on February 2nd, supposedly. And I guess if he comes out and he sees his shadow, then he goes back in his hole. And then I guess that means that there's another six weeks of winter. And if he doesn't go in his hole, then I guess it's an early spring. But I'm thinking like which groundhog? Is well, it like a specific one? Yeah, and like I feel like I think they have a certain groundhog for it. But I feel like it already is like getting spring vibe. Yeah, I gotta look it up because let's see <laughs> if the groundhog came out. What it, it'll say? Yeah. So is it like in one specific place? Or is yeah. it like is it just in Canada? It yeah. sounds like a Did Canadian. Did the groundhog thing. see his shadow twenty twenty four? Seven hours ago. <laughs> So oh, stupid. he's holding the groundhog in the air. Shut up! Yeah, look at this. Right when it comes up. Oh it. my god, stop. Oh no, oh, it went away. Internet. It's official, spring is right around the corner. I mean, uh, I just I just told you that. Punk Sutany Phil did not see a shadow in front of thousands of spectators Friday morning at Gobbler's Knob in <laughs> Panuxtawani, <laughs> Pennsylvania. Part of That's the right, annual yes. Groundhog America. Day tradition. This marks the first time since 2020 that Phil predicted an early spring and the 21st time since records were kept. Wow. Good job, mm. Phil. So what if they just keep him? Like, what if he dies? Is it the end of the world? He, ha he has seen his shadow 107 times Holy and not, <clears throat> not seen his shadow 20 times. Jesus. <gasps> How old? Oh my there God. There were a few years in the late 1800s where there was no record of his forecast. His? So he's yeah. <laughs> what is this? This is so fake. I love it. There he is in the air. There he is in the air. Oh, he saw him for a second. But anyways, so it's U.S. and Canada. Okay. Anyways. Yeah. So okay. All I need from you is if, say, I put it here. Okay. It can go. Up. Ooh, it can turn. It can go up to here if we put it this way. I just want to see if this is a good height, height. for you. Okay. Um. Can you vlog it and hold? Uh, can I can try. It? Does it go down? No. Oh, this is but like this goes now. Maybe just a little lower. That's okay. perfect for me. That's perfect yeah. for me. Right there. Would that be in your way? Well, I'm just trying to see. My mom gave us this because she gets things from work. See, that's the thing is it's going to touch on there. Oh. But what if we put it the other way? It's <laughs> the same. Well, if... Yeah, the other way will be the same. Because the only other way to do it is if we go this way. But I have a feeling... That's going to be the same as like the other way flipped around. Yeah, like height -wise. that's going to be way too high. Okay, let's see. Okay, now I know what height it's supposed to be at. Here are the final results. This is what it looks like. I'm in love with it. It's perfect. I feel like I'm in a hotel room or something. Oh. So if we get out of here. Oh, cold. Okay, I think I need, to, I need to go closer to the eye. But these are very sticky. Oh my god. And like more. Oh, he there. That one's way better. Yes. You know what? We're just gonna. Hopefully, I can restick this like that. Not uncomfortable. Yes. <laughs> Hi. One. Got it. Ooh. There's a goal behind you. I'm gonna score on it. Ready? Block it. Period. Oh, I won. Oh no. <laughs> Going into Costco. She showed her card. Oh, wow. Exclusive you members have to. only. If I don't, they'll ask me for it. You're an exclusive member. No, I'm not. Look <laughs> at all the TV. Star Ooh, gold star. Is that better? No. <laughs> hey, everyone, look at the giant cog. Who would want this also? How much is it? $89 for that. What? If this isn't my dream. Right here. Yeah. You get 12 for 15. I like these. Yeah, I like them too. Root. Darling. Look at all the chickens. These are the best chickens ever. Okay, kind of regret coming here on a Saturday. It's so busy, but we came at like, it's literally, what is it, like 10? 10 o'clock. And it's like madhouse. It seems like Christmas shopping right now. Look at our car just stocked right up. We got a bunch of stuff everywhere. Hot chocolate bombs. They're just still trying to sell those. Like Christmas is over. <laughs> I got this for Austin for our anniversary present because he's really loves camping and stuff. I got this for me, some turkey breast. This for him is also an anniversary present because he loves munchies and it's just such a dramatic thing. I think he'll laugh at that. And then I got these, I'm not keto, they're just low calorie little wraps. I can put the turkey in. Yummy! That's all I got. What is this? Sesame shrimp toast? Those look so good. 
what? They kind of look good, they kind of don't. Like, I don't know, but they're only, they're actually not that bad, $17.99. Oh my God, there's Barbie squishies. They're not the Barbie I like. It's like the iconic Barbie. Oh, there's a pink one. I'm grabbing, oh, oh my God, that's so cute. What? What is it? What? Yeah, but it's just, do I need it? Yeah, you do. <laughs> it's only $10. Is this oh the one you want? Yes, because they're all this. I think people are trying to hide this pink one because you only see oh. this one up here. Oh my god. Yeah, there's only two kinds. This one and that one. And there's only one left. Yeah. <gasps> Thank you. That's so nice. Yeah, I've got this guy. This guy. <laughs> Look, he's guacamole with a taco oh. chip. How oh, bro. <laughs> This right here is $300, $330 worth of groceries at Costco. Mine, oh, she also got one of these chairs too, I should say. But mine, I got the munchies, that and that, and it was, and this, and it was $80 for three items plus the chair. For those who are wondering, this is our Costco menu in Canada. So we don't have anything that you guys have. We don't have the chicken bake in America that you guys have in America. I think you guys have even pretzels. I believe you can get a poutine though, but um, other than that, like we really don't have anything. I, I, I want to try that chicken bake. They have like this chicken bake thing in the States at Costco. It looks so good. It was super nice catching up with my mom, doing a little Costco and thrifting date. I love that. I'm cutting these in half because I don't need one right now. I'm just gonna freeze one. So dramatic and funny. Like I know it's like for probably parties and stuff like that, but he's gonna be so happy about that. I gotta put that upstairs too because I just put away the chair. All right, boys. Oh my God, did you just drink all that? <laughs> yeah. Go on, boys. Go on, boys. Go on. Okay, so I just did a little outfit change here to do two videos. I filmed um, a thrift video and then I did a little recap video for my vlog channel. So that's why I wore this for my vlog channel. I wore a different outfit for my other outfit for my um, thrift haul. Now I'm going to do my try on for my thrift haul. So I'm going to take these out. So go watch the thrift vlog on my main channel if you haven't yet. Who is that? Do you think you're sneaky, do you? <laughs> I am multitasking. I am playing with Shugzi because he's in a very playful mood. Everyone is still in bed, including Austin. Um, and I am playing with this and doing my makeup. <laughs> and then when I have to like focus on like my brows or like my liner, if I'm gonna do it, I just stick it right there. Let it hang and then like we'll like throw it and he'll come running eventually. He's not doing it right now though. And then like wiggle it around until it gets his attention. Oh well, he'll, he'll find it eventually appealing. I can see you hiding under my chair in the mirror and you can see it wiggling, so go get it. There, yep, yep, yep. And I think it's time to retire my lash graveyard. All these lashes have had their day and there's so many mismatched ones. So let's just get rid of them. <laughs> Cleanse. My eye is watering so badly. It is ruining my whole makeup. Every step I do. Just this one eye, not this one. I put on liquid liner and it all ran down. I've been trying to like put like different things on it, but I think I'm just irritating it more. I don't know what, what what it is my eyes used to water a lot um a few years ago and then it like randomly stopped i deep cleaned all my brushes not too long ago i replaced my mascara so i think maybe um after today i'm gonna give my eyes a break from makeup but it just like it keeps running girl like it's running away what are you doing are you in that herbal toothpaste herbal yeah what the hell Jesus. It's supposed to do something. <laughs> it sure I, is. I swear to God, it's every second video on TikTok. I finally got fed up and bought it and hope the videos don't show up anymore. Looks like you've been having fun with Grimace. I am? <laughs> New Grimace trend. Okay, what? I was trying to take a picture of my earrings to post and I don't like this because my ears look red and there's makeup on the side. But like, look, look, what? We have lots of animals, so it could have been one, but bye. I don't know if they look red or not after the first try. I have no idea. <laughs> Almost ready to go? Yeah, why? So am I. One on the left. I. Uh, that was like eight. Really one on the left. One on the right. One on the front and on the back and on the side. <laughs> okay, I've been having fun with earrings lately, as you guys know. So we got this going on right here. And then on this side, I found this cute earring that only had one. I don't even know where I found it, but it looks like it's double. And then I have 
in here. I need to like shave my uh, cyber, sideburns, but I was looking at this one. My tragus that I took out, I wonder if just a regular earring will fit. Let's see. Because I have all these like stray earrings right here. Oh my god, there's a Hello Kitty. And I don't have any like tiny little ones. Oh, I lied. I do. <gasps> oh. Ow. Ow. Okay, yeah, no, that's not working. Okay, we're just not gonna do that because I don't want to be in pain of my period, so bye. Oh, and I'm going to go get waxed. Yes, you can get waxed for your period. And I just use cleansing wipes. I just uh, showered my body. Look it up. There's this like viral thing on TikTok. If I can find the TikTok, I'll link it down below, but there's like things that waxers don't care about. Um, and yeah, I'll link it down below. You guys can watch the TikTok, but oh, bless you, Coop. Bless you, Coop. <laughs> Make sure he's all zipped up in all angles. Yes, I know. And we have a little blankie in there for him. Just a regular checkup, Zeph. He'll be fine. Need that one? He'll be okay. Okay. He's been sitting in the warm car with Austin as I got wax. My my eye stopped watering, so that's good. Let's go get Zeph checked, and he's he's gonna be healthy. But get your pet checked just to be sure. Oh. Yes. We're a bit early, sorry. <laughs> no worries, we can get you in a room. Oh, nice. They have this drop stop. There's this thing on the lens. I'm gonna see if it's, oh my God, what if I fricked up the lens again? We will see. But anyways, don't mind that for now. Look at Nugget, like, okay, artist. Gregory looks like he's got saggy balls. We love that. But here's Zeph. And he's gone. Yeah. He got checked out. I know, we're waiting for a doctor to come in to give him his shots and to go over everything. But yeah, he's looking healthy. Good boy. Look, there's an air freshener in here and it's currently calming and comforting your cat. Let's go. Let's go. Zeph in his little pink bag in the snow. Which truck is your truck? There's two of the same truck. Is it this one? <laughs> I'm so bad at vehicle. Okay, I gave him a list of what to get because I I'm gonna stay in the car with Zef so he doesn't get cold. Here's the reusable bag. He's got his wireless headphones in so no one talks to him. These ones are dying though. There's well, you could pretend. That's what I do on I an still airplane. I don't want to hear anybody. No. <laughs> Okay, you got this. There's not too much. He's tired from his vaccine. He got an updated rabies vaccine. That's all he needed for his updates. Okay, I'm going. Okay. I'll be back. I believe in you. Look at that. I see a free cart right there. <laughs> He's in perfect weight, health. Everything sounds good, lungs, heart, everything. So I'm very happy. Yay for Zeph. He gets really, really tired after his vaccine. So he's just like sleeping. Do you use? Okay, I just did this eyebrow filter on TikTok. It was trending a little while ago, but I'm sitting in the car doing nothing. So I'm uploading stories. These are the stories. Okay, wait, here, look. These are the brows that apparently suit me best. And I feel like like the Bride of Chucky. They're like kind of a sleigh. Austin's been in there for a while and props to him, he hasn't phoned me yet. This cameo that I'm gonna be doing, they asked if I would put it in the vlog. So I'm going to because it's pretty intricate. They paid extra for it. So um, I'm gonna put a little bit more time into it. Yeah, you guys will see a little bit of it. Yeah, you guys can book me on cameo. Link is down below. I really appreciate it. I really, really appreciate you guys all around for that. And Zeph is right beside the heaters. We have all the heat just blasting right on him. He's <laughs> He's doing just fine. He hasn't meowed once. He hasn't made a peep. My man. Thank you to my man. There he is. I bet you he's going to come in here and say something like, they had this really cool thing, so I got it. Like, because <laughs> he knows I like different things, or maybe it's for him. But usually he'll find something cool and, like, has to buy it. He's looking really happy. Why does he look so happy? You probably got something cool. Let's see. Oh, shit. I locked him out. <laughs> Did you find everything okay? Oh, yeah. I got some whipped cream too. <laughs> I knew you were gonna find something different. Oh, oh, and I got, check, you see these? <laughs> They're cheese stuffed. I knew, Yum. I knew, <laughs> I called it! So since Did it one. was so good. <laughs> you heard right away. Oh, there you oh, go. He likes that one. So this is what he was excited for. So basically, um, a husband sent in a cameo for his wife, and he gave me like a list of things that she likes. So I'm gonna try to like incorporate them all in the cameo. Like she likes Harry Potter and Twilight and good food, hairless my hairless cats. Like there's like all this stuff that she likes. So I'm gonna try to incorporate as much as possible, and I'm literally gonna be like Harry Potter and be like Wagolium Leviosa or whatever. I literally have seen Harry Potter once and it was like when it first came out so um I have to do a little bit of research but we're gonna make this work <laughs> hey cat hey cutie ah, it's pink sparkles here at your service who 
No, that was not good. <laughs> Hey, take two. Hey, cat. Hey, cutie. Woo! He tells me that you like literally a Burger King. <laughs> this looks so shitty. Good food. Twilight is the next one. And I have a Team Jacob lip gloss. Twilight. I don't even know how to say this. Hold on, hold on. How to say Harry Potter's spell. Is it not Harry Potter? It's Hermione? Leviosa. 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 Wingardium Leviosa. Okay, we've got this. Harry Potter. If I say this wrong, I might get canceled. <laughs> Look at my wand. <laughs> Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> now I gotta go grab the hairless cat. She better like Team Jacob. Bye. It's cats. My hairless cats, Shugzy and Zeph. Wingardium Leviosa. No, I can't stop saying that. Also the old man Cooper. Thank you, Cooper. Wingardium Leviosa. I got Austin to bring up my little alien because she also really likes aliens. Aliens. Look at my special boy. I'm now out here because I'm filming a little clip for my new vlog intro because I just need like one like silly goofy clip because all of mine are like <sighs> like shit like that. Okay, we're just gonna film it and see if it makes the cut. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. Who's gonna get the snack first? Vote. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say Sophie, even though Shugzy's right Shugzy, in there. Yeah, I think Shugzy. Uh, but Sophie's running away. Shit. He's using his paw, but he's going the other way. It's called Digger, so they actually have to dig. Oh, we're all wrong. Oh, oh, there goes Sophie's paw. Oh, yes. I feel like Zeph will wait until Shugzy gets it out so that he can eat it. Oh. Shugzy took the other one that he got up. We're holding Zeph just so that <laughs> Shugzy can try. <gasps> hey. Zeph's just very like overpowering. So, <laughs> and there's all sizes of them as you guys can see. Oh, they're doing so good. Zeph just gets those out right away. There she goes. I'm holding back both hairless cats. Just so Sophie can get in there. She's like, I'm just a girl. Oh! Yay! Yay. We just loaded up on groceries. We're gonna go have a car wash. We are? Because I've been wanting to have a car oh. wash for the past like three weeks. Are you washing it yourself or are you just driving through? Just driving through. Oh, thank you. I okay. hate washing myself. Yeah. Your feet always get soaked. Oh, uh, of course there's a lineup. Look at all these dirty cars. That's the one that like locks in your tires. Yep. Those scare me. Here we go. You know the rules. Just kidding, I'm the... Oh good. The dirt melting off this guy's car is like so romantic to me. I'm sorry, but this Care Bear sitting on top of a garbage can outside of the liquor store, if that isn't me. If this isn't me sitting on top of a garbage can, I don't know what it is. Hello. <laughs> okay, time to play that game. How much did this cost? In your head right now, uh, try to guess how much this costs. A tiny size of the L'Oreal Gloomy Glotion. It's a glow enhancer. We have some angel eye patch for, for renewing. You could also put them on your neck. We have the e.l.f. Halo Glow Blush. I, I saw Jeffree Star review it and it looked amazing. I've heard other influencers talk about it. And then the new Panorama L'Oreal Mascara. Take a guess. $60! <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, this Serrano pepper that we got to put in, I'm gonna make a homemade soup this week, and I wanted a, to make it a little spicy. 29 cents! <laughs> and look at this gorgeous rainbow cake that I just got to save on food. I know somebody's gonna not believe me, but anyways, Walmart. The first one is the blush, the second one is the patch, the third one is the mascara, and the last one is the Lumi Glow. So a total of $57.57. Okay, I'm gonna do a little Dollarama haul, something a little cheaper. <laughs> and I got some cute stuff. This is how much we got, so let's do a little haul. Okay, first up, we do not buy like brand name paper towels because paper towels in this house are usually just for spills. Dog pee accidents, Cooper's old cat puke accidents, you know, stuff like that. So we just get them a Dollarama. They're like a dollar fifty each. There's no shame in buying anything a Dollarama. Okay, next up, um, I got this for a dollar twenty-five. It's like this little like hair thing. Austin found these for me. I don't think I've ever seen pajamas. They're only four dollars and they're super like cupcakey. Their gravy is so good. 
It, the do not sleep on Dollarama Great. Well, it's actually it's French's, so it's a brand name. But there are uh, two of them for a dollar fifty. We got um, onion and gravy. We always get an onion and a gravy when we go there because they're so good on like chicken, on pork that is the best. Um, mashed potatoes, baked potatoes, like honestly, so good. I always get a little bag of chips. I found these super cute little cat ear. Then we were actually going there for regs because I asked Austin to pick up some regs. There's three in one, and they're three dollars. So they're like a dollar each. I thought we got another pack of rags. Oh, well, we'll see when it comes. Because he was there the other day, and he's like, do you need anything from Dollarama? And I said, yeah, can you get some, like, rags uh, or some dishcloths or whatever? And he knows what I'm talking about, right? And he comes home with this. And I was like, I mean, cool. I like, thank you for, like, the hand towel. <laughs> like, I'll use it. We've been using it. Whatever. We always could use them, so it's not that big of a deal. It's Dollarama. I was like, but we, like, you want me to wash the dishes, like, with this whole thing? And, like, how long is this going to take to dry? And you want me to hang this over? Like, no. Like, <laughs> My dish is piling up because um, you know when um, your dish your dish rags they get like that mildewy smell and I've tried washing them before but I just I just like to just buy them a Dollarama they're cheap enough also needed a uh, new Tupperware these are rubber made some big ones like this for Austin's lunches and then some like this for leftovers they all go away I don't know where they go the we Tupperware is like weird like that Austin got this he needed some microfiber cloths for. I don't know, his car or something like that. I don't know, shit for the garage. I've been seeing on TikTok people using like face oil and then um, like shaving their face with these like little, I've always seen these before or using them on their out eyebrows to shape them. And I have so much peach fuzz on my face. And I've always been like kind of scared to use these because my mom always told me like, if you use these, your hair is going to grow back like twice as thick and faster and everything like that. You know what? I'm, I'm at that age now where like, it's gonna start being like whiskers and you're gonna start like actually like I'm, I'm gonna be like a witch right away so i just picked these up these are lori brand and they're a dollar 25 we needed some little ones as well because we used to have these these are only a dollar 50 and they're all gone we literally just have a lid left of these so i got this ice cube tray i am obsessed with the like, cute ice cubes this was four dollars this was the most expensive thing we got so this is what the packaging looks like before i open it and the brand name before anyone cares it's like this like honeycomb the ice cubes look like they're gonna be like perfectly little cute I have, I'll show you, which I'm gonna throw away. I got these at Dollarama. They were cute for like a moment. So like you fill them like this and then they're actually like balls with ice and then they have like a little snowflakes on them. So you fill water through there, but you can see that they don't quite close all the way. And it's probably just cause it's cheap, but here, like they don't even make circles because they don't close all the way. So they're just like, this is just garbage. So I'm just gonna throw that away. See how this goes. Toilet cleaner, the Lysol hydrogen peroxide. He got some mini egg. He got an orange Gatorade. He was like, we're running low on ketchup. I'm like, I don't like put ketchup pretty much on anything. I put it on like meatloaf and sometimes fries and like plain chips. <laughs> and I just got one of these for when I'm doing like a lazy, if I'm lazy or if I'm hungover and if I'm hungry. He got these gardening hooks. He says he uses them for work. I don't know what for. And even if he did tell me, I probably wouldn't remember. So <laughs> yeah, that was it. We are doing our recycling right now. <laughs> Lots of it. That's one way to do it. <laughs> you ever heard of a trash compactor? <laughs> ah, no, that's why I broke my lens before. Bye. Okay, let's see this. Why would I go hot water? Like, what's wrong with me? Look at that. Ooh, honeycomb. Fill the little holes. Look at that. Okay, now this lid, I don't think is gonna go on securely. Okay, it's the lids. Like, they're so flimsy, but I, f I have high hopes for this. Alrighty, so far so good. Ooh, no leak, no mess. <gasps> Just went to put the craft dinner down and bam! Knocked over all the crispy onions. <laughs> the fact that they're like flakes too, like, bye. Okay, so this is our grocery. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. There's also the cake but we also got this i'll show you guys what i'm gonna do there's this feta right here there's this um kale crunch salad and then austin's favorite whatever brand name that is this elbow macaroni salad a lot of this a lot of the vegetables like here mainly are for that soup so i'm gonna make a soup then there's just like other things for the week for like salads so we do not have a pf chang's where we are and our walmart started selling these they were on sale for, on rollback for three dollars so there's sweet chili and then there's sesame. I don't know which one yet, but I'm gonna marinate chicken for tomorrow, and I think I'm gonna do the sesame. What are you doing now? 
I am gonna go rearrange and clean up the garage. Is this one okay for our chicken for tomorrow? That's gonna be amazing. Thank you, baby. You're welcome. Oh, I didn't even say about the um, pasta, or not pasta, the soup. Like, I have a recipe on my cooking channel of how I make my tomato soup, but this time I'm gonna add a brick of feta cheese with everything baking. It's gonna be so good, so I'm very excited. All right, I seasoned my chicken, and then I put some of the sesame dressing in here, and I watered it down with some water, obviously, and then I put some garlic, and I think that's gonna be a good consistency because it was very thick. That looks good. That looks good. Nice and covered. Mood today. I love this candle. Smells like quit asking me shit, geez. And Austin put the anniversary card I made him right next to his side up. Okay, so here's our soup. I'm gonna give it some salt. I love how this looks. All right, let's throw it in. So let's take these, take these and like just go like that. Try not to get any sticks in there. It's bad up anyway. Everything? Um, not the garlic. Everything but the garlic. salt. Yep. Yup. And the result is OMG. Can't forget the basil. Never, never, never. <laughs> kind of burnt, but and we're back to today. I still have some more older ones, but um, I'll put them in in another vlog. But I'm gonna check my lottery tickets. I have I don't know why I have so many. Like, do I really think I'm gonna win the lottery? But <laughs> but um, I'm gonna check those. And uh, if I come back on here and say I won the lottery, I have, let's 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 do that. Let's ready? Here we go. Literally nothing. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to end out the vlog here. I'm glad I caught you guys up on a bunch of new clips or old clips, not new clips. <laughs> and a lot of you guys have um, questions about Cooper and how he's doing. Here's Cooper. He's doing just fine. No issues at all. Very healthy. He runs around. He has no issues. So there's a little update on Coop there. And we're gonna read the joke to end up this vlog because I have not read a joke in a long time. So let's do it together. Ready, Coop? He's gonna leave. I know. Because I just turned on this heated blanket and yeah, he's gonna go right in between the cats. Okay, ready? Why shouldn't you tell a joke to an Easter egg? It might crack up. I feel like everyone knows that joke already. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys all in my next vlog. Bye.